This is music, and this is almost like Christmas, except it's better than Christmas. All right, so around noon today, uh, there was a very aggressive, actually, knock on my door. Uh, when I opened, it turned out that it was the postman bringing me this VCLT from none other than the mighty metal Marty Mac himself. So it's come all the way from Ireland. I really appreciate that. That is awesome. Thanks. Now, I knew it was on the way, but I have no idea what's in it other than it being some CDs and some cassettes. And as far as I understand, uh, some of the cassettes are from Enda's uh, collection, in which case it's a real honor to uh, sort of have them in my collection now. But yeah, let's uh, actually un... I mean, so this is a padded mailer, so I guess let's unpadded mailer this and i have not pre-cut it because uh, uh, i don't think that far ahead of time so i'm going to have to cut my way into it and that's probably going to be awkward but uh while doing that yeah it's it's absolutely awesome this um uh, vinyl community that we share things with one another and send things to one another that we think uh, the people might like. I think that's absolutely awesome. And uh, I really appreciate uh, Metal Marty Max sending me this. Uh, obviously, uh, you didn't have to do that, uh, Marty, but I mean, I'm not going to pretend that I'm that I don't like receiving VCLT, you know what I mean? So uh, I really appreciate it. I think it's awesome. I have now uh, cut my way into it. Um, so let's see. Um, so very, very, very well bubble wrapped here. Uh, feels like some cassette tapes. And uh, looks like some uh, the CDs here. And there is a note as well. Uh, so that is awesome here. A personal note. That's excellent. Um, great stuff. So let's uh, have a look at... I'm going to have a look at the cassettes first. So uh, some scotch tape. Keeping everything in place. A rubber band. Because... I apparently I collect rubber bands now like everybody else seems to be doing so that is interesting so up first oh this is awesome dirty looks uh, cool from the wire I had this one on vinyl uh, when I was a kid uh, really liked it just awesome hard rock kind of like on the glammy side uh, I would say with Probably some ACDC kind of inspiration. I don't think that's incorrect. So I had this on vinyl when I was a kid. And I sold it uh, along with my entire vinyl uh, connection, collection back in the day. I sold it to a friend. Very cheap. I have not regretted selling my collection to a friend. Because it was somebody who was into collecting vinyl at the time. And I was not. So it was just sitting in my parents' barn basically. Um, so never regretted it, but it's really awesome to have it now in cassette tape format. So I really appreciate it. Thanks, man. That's, that's awesome. Dirty looks. That is great. So, uh, up next, grade two, Anthrax, the sound of, the sound of perseverance. That's not even Anthrax, that's death. Uh, sound of white noise. There you go. Uh, awesome you know i've never seen this one in cassette tape format before um i saw it in uh, metal marty max and uh, one of his videos going through um so i think this is from enda's uh, collection going through enda's collection because i seem to remember 
seeing this one and commenting on it's pretty awesome and that I've never seen it in cassette tape format before, which I haven't. Uh, this was the album that got me into Anthrax. Um, and so it has a really, really uh, special place uh, in my life. Um, I have it on, uh, on CD, but I don't have it on cassette tape. So it's great to have it on cassette tape. I really look forward to to listening to it. Um, very 90s looking uh, chrome uh, cassette tape. So that is awesome. Thanks for Sound of White Noise, not of Sound of Perseverance. And thanks for the Dirty Looks cassette. Really awesome. I really, really appreciate uh, those two. That's that's great. And also because I think they're from Enda's collection. So I also feel actually uh, quite honored that they are now in my collection. Okay, cool. So let's turn to the CDs. Um, so let's see here some. Ah, so this is Witch Mountain. And this one is what is brand new. That's. All right mint sealed and everything that's great uh looks uh, i don't think i know uh, this band um but i seem to remember having seen it seen it in a video maybe in a metal marty mac video maybe another video uh, it's out on svart records um and really intrigued um don't know what it is Maybe I've commented on a video where somebody described it, but I can't remember, but it seems really intriguing. So that that's exciting. I look forward to giving this uh, a listen and basically, you know, it's going to be a first impression probably. So that that's awesome. What else do we have here? Um, <laughs> baby metal. So it's 10 baby metal years. I, I don't think they can continue being babies. You know what I mean? <clears throat> so, yeah. Fun. Uh, Japanese. Uh, they started out being little girls. Uh, singing kind of fun heavy metal songs. And I think now they're not little girls anymore. But I think they're still active. Uh, so that's going to be fun. Never had a metal, uh, baby metal um, release ever in my collection. But as some of you know, I do really um, like, I'm really fascinated with the Japanese hard rock and metal scene. So that's going to be fun. I really look forward to listening to, to this one. It's going to be great fun. Uh, what else do we have here? Uh, Heavy Water, Red Brick City. So um, don't know what that is, but uh, the, the title uh, rings a bell. So that's also going to be super. Oh, okay, yeah, I yeah. I know actually uh, this because it says here an album by Sepp and Biff. Uh, this is Biff Byford, I think it is um, from Saxon. So I have heard this one before. This one is actually great. Uh, just heavy, heavy rock. I uh, received a um, digital promo version of, of this, but I'd much rather have it in physical format. And as far as I remember, it's just great heavy rock, you know, by a legend of the metal universe and his son, who is probably getting just as legendary. So that's awesome. And again, I mean, brand new. So you didn't have to do that, but I super appreciate it. That's awesome. Uh, so now, Baby Metal and uh, the the Bifords. That's awesome. And last, uh, Skull Archer here. Don't know what this is, I think. Um, so that's going to be another uh, first impression. Uh, so yeah, these will probably make an appearance, an appearance at some point in some of the first impressions videos too. So that is great so i really appreciate uh, receiving this um vclt some absolutely amazing and intriguing items so again uh, sound of white white noise by anthrax the album that got me into anthrax dirty looks um happy to have it back in my collection certainly uh as i said i sold it off i had it on vinyl sold it off I haven't regretted selling it, but it's just great to have it back in my collection. Witch Mountain, 
um, intriguing. It does ring a bell, but I'm not sure what it is. Uh, but if it's out on Svart Records, it's got to be quality. And Baby Metal with classics such as Doki Doki Morning, uh, Headbanger, um, Gimme Chocolate. There's a song called that. And there's a song called Karate. I, I don't know that one. The One is a song as well. And Papaya, which features Hero. So uh, it's going to be fun. Look, I actually kind of look forward to, to listening to this. You know, It's going to be a fun listen. Uh, and Heavy Water, Red Brick City, uh, Biff Byford and Sip Byford. Uh, they're awesome heavy rock uh, release, which as far as I remember, they released um, because they had to do something during, uh, you know, all the COVID stuff. So they decided to make an, an album and, you know, just to, to stay productive and stay creative and great stuff. And up last, the mystery Skull Archer. So awesome. Really appreciate this. Uh, thank you so much, Metal Marty Mac. Uh, henceforth, you shall be known as Santa Marty Mac. So uh, there you go. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Uh, I'm going to have a blast spinning all of these. Thanks for watching.